<gasps> oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Huge. <laughs> Huge news. Plot twist. Grizzle brand. <laughs> Jump scare. <laughs> What's up and welcome everyone to a new Timeless video. Timeless is a new Magic the Gathering format that is every card on MBG Arena with no bans and a few restrictions that also includes the new Cans of Tarkir cards. So in this deck we are building around Sneak Attack, a 4 mana enchantment that has an activated ability for 1 red mana that says you may put a creature card from your hand onto the battlefield. That creature gains haste, sacrifice it at the beginning of the next end step. So what are we cheating in play with this deck? We are cheating in a Traxa Grand Unifier, World Spine Worm and of course fan favorite Grizzlebrand. Now in a perfect world we can start pumping out our bombs with Sneak Attack on turn 3 because this deck has access to Dark Ritual. So for instance on turn 2 we can run out sneak attack and then be able to pay for the ability on turn three or on turn three with three mana up of which two have to be red we can dark ritual into sneak attack as well it can technically be even faster if ragavan gets played on turn one and successfully attacks to give you treasure now this deck also plays necropotence which is a very broken three mana enchantment that just basically draws you a bunch of cards in your end step and will almost always give you the cards you need to successfully play sneak attack and cheat in your bombs let me tell you nothing feels better than a turn one dark ritual into necropotence and this deck can do exactly that. I think it requires much more aggressive mulligans than I did in this video and next time I'm playing this deck I'll be a lot greedier with it which should make it play a lot better. All right before we get into some gameplay don't forget to like and subscribe and let me know what your favorite degenerate combo in timeless is in the comments below. All right let's get into some sneak attack and gameplay. It's, it's not gonna it's not gonna work for me. Necropotence on three could maybe get us towards like, you know, ritual and sneak and payoff. I think it's keepable. I'll give it a shot. I'll give it a shot. Get some good interaction. So, um... Oh, brother, what is this? Lotus Control? Okay, very complex deck, hard to understand. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Or is it, um, something, something, Field of the Dead? Is that possible? Anyways, our Blood Moons will love this matchup. Yeah, the Stifles, probably just Band Control. I don't know. I'm feeling confident I can fire off Necropotence here. I don't know why they... I mean, something that's suspicious is like, why on earth did I not just do Sylvan's Crying, but... I'm gonna try it. What do we go to? Like, do we just dig super deep here? I think you do. Yeah, let's keep it at two. Oh, 
Buy two, not one, in case we need, like, the land. And once again, we didn't we didn't get to do it. <laughs> once again, we just didn't. So that would be sick if we had more than one land. I would snap keep the fuck out of that. I can though. Okay, that's a different beast. Looking for a timeless experience try this. with the best of the besties? Then hit that sub button to Ashleepsel for a tale as old as time of being Pog. <laughs> don't fall fate to the history books. Make your day timeless. So don't delay. Hit that sub button to Ashleepsel today. Thank you so much, Astral. Appreciate that. What a nice message. Thank you for the 15. Little, little ad. Narset's reversal? Huh. Ooh, okay. I wanted to like prevent getting like stifled, maybe. Maybe I still am. Maybe I should have waited. I guess I don't know. Didn't know if their last card was gonna be rainstorm. Narset infinite turns. Oh brother. <laughs> oh brother. Off we go. Hmm. I definitely didn't play that turn right. I didn't think they had Brainstorm. I should have known. I guess. Let me try it. Evil hag the fairy. Die. Thank you. Well, that was easy. I didn't think I, <laughs> I didn't think it was gonna go, but I'll take it. So they didn't have a counter then, or not one that they felt worthy. Do I just go for it? I mean, if you tap that way, I'm gonna... Why? Why Why are you so determined to double tap those... The fuck? Smells like a spell beers. I don't know. It could just be like, negate. I don't know. Okay. Sneaking? Dishanat's Tidebinder? All right. <laughs> all right. Well, what kind of control deck is that? But all right. Maybe they look themselves with Brainstorm. I don't know. Uh, turn on Ragavan. That's all we need. Let's go. <laughs> uh, no, no, no. Let's see if we can get this uh, Necropotence on like turn, turn one or some shit like that. It's not giving. It's not giving. You both have taken two mulligans. We have a bolt and a thought season here, and we are on the play. This might be a keep. We do have the dark ritual too. Hmm. 
Like, I'm just going to keep those at the bottom. I guess we... I, I guess this has to be a keep. Channel combo. <laughs> Please. It's so cool to play with these cards on Arena, though. Like, I am living my best life. Oh. Interesting. So we're up against just like, is that Murktide without Murktide? Um, Murktide less Murktide. I guess you grab the Spell Pierce. I guess you grab the Spell Pierce. Channel. <laughs> you could still play Channel, I think, if you just play like a, a... I think you could still successfully play a Channel deck if you just play a bunch of like tutors. I think it's possible. As long as you just have, like, the one channel available, maybe. Oh, shit. Kind of whiffing here, uh... Grizzlebrand when? <laughs> I think a lot. I think a lot. I think there's a lot of them, uh... I mean, um, the Demonic Tutor is obviously restricted to one, but... Uh, fuck it, I'll just pop this. Instance and Sorcery Tutor? Um, <laughs> Ragavan is just dead to Fiery Impulse? I don't know. I mean, I guess it would prevent them from, like, brainstorming right now. I don't know how much we care about that, though. I don't know. I just wait, I think. Solve the equation. I mean, there's a bunch of, like, two mana ones. Like, there's also one that, like, you have to sacrifice a creature for or something like that. You could play that with, like, Bowmasters. I think if you could, you could... If you wanted to, you could get there, I think. You could make a channel deck, but... The hoops you gotta th jump through are just ridiculous, though. Alright, opponent, let it be something good. Mm-mm. It'd be a brainstorm. Interesting. Do I fire it off? Yeah, why not? Deathrite Shaman? Yeah, but... I don't have, like, the... Why, like, so many dark rituals? <laughs> Like, what am I going to do with these? We're, uh, we're not drawing the right side of the deck, I fear. Would have loved a fetch there to get rid of them. We can now get Brainstorm locked in MTG Arena. Yippee! I'm just going to look. Grizzle. Yeah, Grizzle would be a vibe. Fuck it. There we go again. Vibes. Vibes. Me and my three dark rituals. Crying. Shaking. You get locked in historic. Yeah, I've got I got locked in historic before, and then I realized really quickly how to not get locked. But I've definitely been locked before. Not ashamed to admit it. Baby's first brainstorm lock, but that was then. Yeah, this is really like the nightmare blend rotation. 
like fucking stuck with three dark rituals in my hand like it really is nightmare blunt rotation it's bad it's bad yeah it was tricky like i remember playing that like rogue stack in historic that played like memory lapse and brainstorm which was broken as fuck um but yeah i played it i played it and yeah i really realized pretty quickly how to the work with brainstorm definitely anyways me and my three dark rituals what are we gonna do kiss no cry most likely yay it's back wow Oh, this is on the Bowmaster. I don't care. Any Ulamogs? No. <laughs> What's in your hand? I have no idea. Just a bunch of burn? Oh, a memory lapse. Great. I'm not drawing shit. <laughs> I'm not drawing shit. Nightmare blunt rotation. Where's the pearl? I'm a star. Oh, I'm a star. <laughs> Please, I'm a star. Please, I'm a star. <laughs> you can't do this. You can't do this. Me, my three dark rituals. I'm taking to the park. Is there a memory that shits on counterspell? It's true. <laughs> it's fucking true. All right. Well, that would have been great. I'll I'll save that bloodstained mire in the case that you know the universe might grace me with another uh, another brainstorm. Who knows? Got my mana covered. Nah, it's true. It's true. Yeah. Anybody want a free dark ritual? You know you do. No. Get out of here, monkey. I mean, honestly, like, wait, just wait till we get Grizzle Brand and we pop off. Okay, what? I'll pay. Wait, you want me to use my dark ritual? Try me. Oh, shit. They were good for something. Oh, oh. Oh shit, the value! <laughs> the value! Man. Crazy. Oh, fuck off. I'm playing 20 lands though. All right. More mana than God. Nah, really though. Really? <laughs> Ugh. This is great. Welcome to Timeless, everybody. Okay, we got we got ourselves a memory lapse. Sick. Um, I guess. Back to the top you go. We should Delver. <gasps> oh, sh oh, oh, wait, 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 wait! Huge, <laughs> huge news. Oh, fuck. Yo, Grizzle. Hey, Grizzle. I mean, uh, I'm not gonna, like, draw right now, but... Plot twist, Grizzle brand. <laughs> Jump scare. Jump scare. Ash Grizzle. <laughs> Real should be my new name. I'm not gonna gamble right now. They could find a bolt or something and it's over. I'm not doing that. I'll, I'll gain some life first. I'll gain some life first. Like, I'm not doing that. I'm not playing that game. I mean, okay, I'm, if they if they like tap out like that, I'll I'll be brave enough. Like I was about to say, like, I'll be brave enough to, like, activate it if you tap out. Like, because I'm not going to get bolted. So, double Inquisition of Kozilac, a sneak attack, and an Atraxa. I mean, this is a key. Definitely. Four color shadow. I still need to build shadow. I, I literally just, like, I... Um... 
I'm guilty of, uh, oh shit, well, hold on. I might have to play my own Ragavan here. Nah, I will just do Inquisition. I'm guilty of, like, putting a sorcery speed removal spell on Goyf without a sorcery in a grave. Oops, where I thought they had it. It was sad. Oh god, what a hand, dude. What a hand. Darcy, I guess. So many cool decks, yeah. It's true. We'll be brewing uh, mostly timeless this week, even though I still have a bunch of standard decks left of fours. They stole my bolt. That is so sick and twisted. Hopefully we can get it with the Bowmasters. It's very rude, it's true. Thank you. Thank you. And go ahead and draw those cards. Thank you. Good, good, good value right there. Yeah, good value. This is why I play the Bowmasters. And a 4-4. Four, four. Some Darcy's. It's the last card. So that would be getting to sneak attack already they got something right they got something there would it really be a counter spell last card play it safe. We could also top stop like a land, right? It was a brainstorm. Just play Ragavan regularly. Yeah, I don't know. Better safe than sorry, I guess. We might still just stop like, like, you know, a land. They're also just doing good with Bowmasters, though. I don't think there's much they can do. <laughs> yeah. All right, we got them. We'll take it. Oh, we got the sneak attack. <laughs> and we got the attract us. Wow, this is a really weird fucking hand. I don't know if I won this. We don't have the dark rituals. We don't have the treasures. I don't know. Like, I, I'm, I ship that, I think. I mean, this is really not doing anything. All right, this could cook. This could cook. Hold up. This could cook. The brainstorm do be a little, a little awkward here, though. I might get rid of that. Okay. Self suggesting fun. <laughs> you can brainstorm and, and fetch. No, I am aware how brainstorm works. Uh, I don't forget. I did like what? Like a full, like however many weeks of modern Monday. Like we have, I did play with like brainstorms and fetches and all that. Did I not thrive with the Murktide deck? I am aware, but obviously, like I, I am aware. Come on now. Oh shit. Is it gonna be done to us? Mech Warrior! Hey, thank you so much for the 10 gifties. Holy shit, appreciate that. Thank you. 
Oh shit, we dead. I fear. I fear. Oh god, I, are we literally playing a mirror? Wait, how is this possible? Oh fuck, oh brother. Actually dead? I don't know, like I haven't played the deck yet, so I'm not sure how I'm supposed to mulligan with this. I'm uh, I'm not sure. I don't know. I don't even know if we survive this, really. We're in the fucking mirror. It's scary out here. I mean, I feel like the right answer has to be like your sneak attack or like necropotence. It's gotta be. Let's try to like beat them at their own game. I don't know, gamers. I'll just grab sneak attack. Pulp deck, uh, dark rich or dark ritual will be fine. Easy, I work. Oh god. Opponents like us, but they're doing better. <laughs> don't like us, but so so much better. I fear. Dark, dark ritual one time. Right? Dark Ritual one time. I can look for it. Dark Ritual one time. <gasps> wait, wait, wait. Oh my god, it's there. I guess we just win then, right? Or are we like one mana short? No. Yes. We're one short, aren't we? Yeah. Like, we could just dash Ragavan this turn. Yeah. I wonder, like, do we ever... Is there a world where we put back Grizzlebrand and World Spine Worm? Okay, I have no time for this, but so I'm just gonna have to, like... I'm just gonna have to do this because I have no time, but I think I'm gonna, like... Play it s somewhat safe because... Wait, what? Oh, I timed out. I was about to say, why did I skip through my turn? Okay. Um, yeah, anyway, so my plan was to just put the worm on the top of the deck, but I guess I got fucked. That was really strange, though. I guess I've timed out because... Okay. Well, shit. <laughs> I was gonna put a roll spine worm, like, at the top of the deck, like, prevent ourselves from, like, getting hit by something or whatever, but... You know. Yeah, no, that didn't work out. Yeah, that's what I was gonna do, Fire. That was the plan. Um, but obviously I had no fucking time. But yeah, that was what, it was what I had in mind. The idea was there. Execution, not really, but that was the plan. Oh, whatever. Are we still alive? I have no idea. No clue. Anyway, had the right idea, not the right, the l enough time, shit. 
That feels bad. We had it. No, we didn't have it that turn, but... They're so crazy for this. Wait, where's their lands at and shit? From it is intimidating. I can definitely understand that, like... I, uh... I can definitely understand that. It's even intimidating as fuck for me to play. Like, I just timed out, you know? Like, there it is. Like, <laughs> GG's. We tried. It's hard. It's tricky. It's tricky. It's tricky. Is it the Kiki Jiki? So many decks and combos to keep track of. Yeah, like a bunch of new cards that you would normally like never play with too, you know? Quite scary. All right, give me another bowl, please. Wow, they're so greedy with that. Do I not just look for Bolt now? Keep up the good work, Ash. Do we not just... How does this work? It should be. Stick 18 to hope for Bolt. Yeah. You know, opponent can fuck us up, right? Okay. Baby's first Necropotence never been fortunate enough to play with the cards, so... Might as well try. Surely, surely, surely. To be fair, I think the opponent would have put themselves in bold range anyway. Like, they've been kind of playing like that, but... Stay at four in case they have bold. I think you just commit. Because staying at four, they just deck with Goblin Shaman and we dead as well. I think we commit. I think we commit. All right, last one. Come on, man. Come on. Come on, baby. <laughs> Give me that bolt. All right, cool. Thank you. We ate that up. <laughs> Not even close, yeah. Still takes out their potential regavans and stuff is what I'm imagining, so. that I'm sure it'll play. I'm sure it'll play. Bessie out here playing Pain Lens and Modern? Oh. Or <laughs> I guess Heimless. Slumming my Bowmaster. Also, they played Fable, so Bowmaster works against that too. Very, very nicely. Bro doesn't want to spend the rares. Honestly, respect, but if they had to spend it on like sneak attack and all that shit, like I if I would never recommend any like Magic the Gathering Arena free-to-play player to waste their resources on sneak attack. Like, I'm gonna have to be real with you on that one. 
should probably let this happen. I would not recommend that for real. See, they are sneak attack. There you go. Oh, brother. <laughs> Ooh, this one spell pierce against the world, I'm afraid. Oh, man. Wait, why would they not just run it out and... Wait, what? Okay. I'm confused why they, why they wouldn't just run it out. Why would you give me an opportunity to get, like, a thought seize? Okay, well, that's not gonna do shit. Shit, what a game this is gonna be, huh? Oh, brother. I wish. I wish I could. All right. Here's a sneak attack to Traxa first up. Well. A sneak attack mirror like i'm this might be like the fucking seventh circle of hell i fear <laughs> all right there goes the traxa oh god grizzlebrand and shit necromentia I, well i don't think i'm dead i could pull back i mean i could pull back for sure i have the necropotence well enough that would do too much but you know, I could draw. Nope, just the land. Um, that's GG's. Okay, so Demonic Tutor gives me sneak attack. We got Bowmasters, so we're gonna try it. Yeah. It's real, it's real. I mean, honestly, you might as well. These little fuckers, they keep having it, huh? <laughs> Gotta grab that. I think I got good hands. Maybe I need to be more aggressive with my mulligans. I constantly feel like I have popcorn stuck in their teeth. Yeah, that's the worst. That's the worst. That'd be a good one. That would be a good one. <laughs> Chat with the the, ang the repressed anger. Respect. Seven months hey, Velociraptor! Are you going to Magic Con Chicago I am, I am, yeah, I'll be in Chicago. I will be. Ragadash! Ragadash denied. I just keep thinning my deck out, like... Give me low lands, give me only sneak attacks. Thank you very much. The Zubat cry. <laughs> I miss the Zubats. No, you're not getting it. This is not what we need.
to fully just grab blue dare and try to bait him, but... What a horrible timing on that one. Twenty. Twenty lands. Go masters with slay. Seventy-five K standard. It is. Yeah, it is. I might play. I'm not sure yet. Yo, give me that sneak attack, bestie. Like, that's what we need. Sneak attack when? Necropotence when? This time we could just potence for like bolts and shit. Oh. Well. <laughs> Interesting. Meetups in Chicago? Yeah, of course, of course. We did them in Vegas too. There will absolutely be meetups in, uh, in Chicago. I think Cheese was even saying to like rent or like find a karaoke bar that we <laughs> could all go to. Now that I'm a karaoke girly, but you know, we can have some, uh, we can have a good time. We got this. So, uh, I mean, to find two bolts. And they could still bolt us. I think we passed the turn. And we could draw, like, we could get a little greedier on our turn and draw some cards. Yeah, I'm deaf holding up peers. I think I just pass. We have our deep dish. No, I haven't. I haven't. This is not sorcery speed, is it? So, how does this interaction work? Whenever you discard a card, exile that card from your graveyard. Same when I've exiled a top card of your life face down. If I put it in the exile, can they grab it? Yeah, right? Like, we can just exile cards now. So... What's the worst case scenario for us? I'm holding up spell pierce, so don't have to worry about bull. Like, what kind of life can we go through is the important thing. What's the worst case scenario? I think we go to four. I think we go to four. I agree with four. Yeah, I think bolt bolt's the worst case. So four needs to be the right number. Opponent will know exactly like what's going on over here. You get those cards to your end set. Let's see how many sneak attacks are in there. <laughs> Three of them. Now survive, yep. Now survive. We might even have bolts, yeah. I guess we'll find out. No, I still think you gotta play it safe. Also, I'm not in full control. Like, stop, 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 stop. Game? Be nice. So we have the win here. Uh, this game is just acting up, though.
Here we go. We're just gonna go master and bolt. Okay. All right. Well, we got the mirror. <laughs> yeah, we didn't even fire off a sneak attack. We just lived. <laughs> we just lived. This could be keepable. But it's also not how our deck plays. Like, we could brainstorm Mook for a land and we'd give ourselves access to memory lapses, bowmasters. Perhaps lightning bolts, but... This isn't what we do. So I think we mull. So we got a sneak attack here. We got a grizzle brand. We just have to... We have a reg van. I guess I'm keeping this one. I think keeping that one. Ooh, got ourselves a brainstorm. Interesting. Gonna play Ragavan. New players will just like brainstorm like card draw when reality is fixing. Yeah. I think that's true. Yeah, we just gotta look for Dark Ritual. So I'm just gonna find like a... Um, watery Grave here, I think. Now we're gonna Brainstorm. Let's see if we can find... And we can always like use the Bloodstained Mire to get rid of some cards that we want to put to the bottom. I mean, tap out challenge? We could, mm, I don't know. See so many bad brainstorms. It's a tricky card, like, it's a very tricky card. I don't blame people. Uh, I guess I'll try sneak attack, like, I mean, is it gonna succeed? No, but I guess we try, right? Archmage's Charm. Yeah, I think we got no choice on that one. I think we got no choice. Awkward, I guess. Fuel to death while our Blood Moon is like a... celebrating. <laughs> our Blood Moon is celebrating. As your buddy likes to say, there are no right ways to play Brainstorm and a million wrong ways to play Brainstorm. Very true. Demonic Tutor. Very interesting. Maybe the right play is to like bolt to fairy first. Maybe tutor into like dark ritual. That seems to be the play.
I mean, you could also grab Necropotence, to be fair. It's so difficult. Like, how much do we believe, you know, that we can fire something off? We're also at 11 life. You could just do Necropotence. What do you think is the play, chat? Ritual or necro Necropotence? Rick ritual could allow us to sneak attack. Just, just fuck it, ritual. That's just that's just fucking ritual. Let's do it. Let's fuck around, find out. Please stick. Snapcaster Mage, bring back Counterspell. Fuck. Hmm. Okay. If you knew you were topping a land, Thoughtseize was the pick. Oh, definitely. If we knew. Yeah. If we knew, it would absolutely have been the play. But hard to predict that, you know? Hard to predict that. We just have a Blood Moon sideboard and hope for the best, I think. Oh no, we can still tilt that uh, sneak attack. Well, I mean, we're already used to, but you know. Another land. Hardcasting Grizzle Daddy very soon. <laughs> Grizzle Daddy Hardcast. Yeah. Get in there. Get in there. Ideally, not what we do, but it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Oh shit! We're we're just dead as fuck. All right, that was unfortunate. Moon soon, TM. So we're gonna get Blood Moon. What the f do we grab? The fairy? I think the fairy. Slam Blood Moon. I mean, I guess technically Inquisition of, Inquisition of Goza like first in case they don't like spell beers, I guess. Um, we grab Unholy Heat. I guess they might grab a... Okay. Snow-covered island. Yep. Memory. Table thrives. 
Should buy us enough time, I hope. We'll see. Blood Moon strats. <laughs> he attracts that treasure dream. You may say I'm a dreamer. I mean, I'm not, but... Damn, they drew that? <sighs> Alright. <laughs> well, I'm still manifesting sneak attack at some point, so... Or a way to get there. But we could also just be beat. I don't know. I don't know. They still have treasure cruises. Blood Moon Art's cool as fuck, though. Not happening on that one. <laughs> Not happening on that one, Chief. We need to draw. Uh, we need to draw a little bit better. Oh God. I um. It's sad that they are still very much uh, able to play their shit. I think maybe I should have. I think in hindsight I shouldn't have cast the Blood Moon that quickly. I should have just let them grab their shit and then slam the Blood Moon, because they would have probably gone for duels rather than like a basic unless they predicted blood moon that would have been bad but yeah i mean the thing is i just need to find a sneak attack and i'm good but we'll see i think we should have played that a little differently also the opponent had a lot of interaction there which kind of sucked yeah it slows everything down enough for sure I got the treasure cruise though. Pretty bad. Now hold it. <laughs> now hold it. Now hold it. Hello. It's true. Uh, how much do we draw? Just six? Oh, fuck. This is going to be tough to predict. What's the worst case scenario? I mean, there's a lot of worst case scenarios. I don't know if they play like bolts and shit. I think I draw six. Yeah, there's a helix in hand already, so I'm not going to go to five. Den is shut down by Blood Moon. Demonic Tutor. So like surely no white there we go we got him <laughs> blood moon we would have actually had it next turn too because we could have just done like demonic to or dark ritual demonic tutor for sneak attack we could have also fired off an inquisition it probably would have been like dark ritual inquisition demonic tutor for sneak attack and then um just get a traxa i mean i guess you could have also seized but we would have had it i think <laughs> i think we would have had it yeah, we're not doing that. So we got to turn one Inquisition and we have some Bowmasters. Potence and Fable. No Blood Moons. Opponent keeps seven. This is just where you're trying to figure out, like, can we beat them with this? Probably not, I would imagine. Probably not. It's hard, like, it's fucking tough to figure out, especially because we have so little, like, experience in these matchups. 
It's torn, but do you, do, you, do you keep this, which is definitely playable, or do you just fall to the walls, find ritual, find sneak attacks, go for it? Find blood moon, you know, also very important. You could also just go for a blood moon strategy. But his hand is definitely playable. It's about like how greedy do you want to get? If you already are on a keep six. I think I try this. No, I'm not dropping Fable, I don't think. We don't even have sneak attack payoff. And Fable can just help us draw in sneak attacks and payoffs. Imagine on Amsterdam. I'll be in Amsterdam, I'll be in Chicago. Um, I'm planning to go to like almost all magic cons if I can, so come and hang out, you know? Maybe we'll do some more uh, in-person like tournaments as well, the best tour tournaments, so uh memory lapses. It's true, it's true. Opponent just uninstalled after getting Blood Mooned. <laughs> Complaining on Reddit, why is Blood Moon legal? Why is Blood Moon not restricted? A Reddit threat. Oh no. Like, actually? Actually? I'm gonna... Oh, 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 oh. Just, just BM. Okay. Fuck you. Wow. No white. Two unholy heats. Snapcaster. I mean, I guess I should prepare for like the worst case scenario, right? I should just prepare myself for the worst case of them like double decking white. There you go. Yeah, immediate white off the top. Crazy. They got away with that one. Some decks. Yeah, a lot there's a lot of red decks. Like there's a lot of like is that stuff going around and all that, so um yeah, probably dove in speedo. We might just be able to cast Fable and Curve, hopefully. Yeah, but yeah, there's like a lot. There's a lot of uh, red decks and stuff that would just be fine. Dragon Rage Chandler might be the like most played card that I've seen all day, so. Just stifled an opponent's Stasis Oracle trigger. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, they're scared. They didn't go for white. I guess they... Okay. Man, I would have really loved a, uh... You stupid mm. fucking dinosaur! Get, Get the, the fuck, fuck out of here! I mean, let's just get some things out, I guess. Bolton and Nerf Darcy, yeah. Classic, you know? Come on, give me a land. Don't be shy. A Blood Moon! No, I need a land. Shit. We might be in trouble. I don't know. They now have um, Snapcaster Mage into Dovin's Veto. Bait. 
Oh, not falling for it. Makes sense. Mm, I think this is a loss. Them top decking that land was so bad. So bad. They keep like they also opponent kept two lands by the way and they've just been thriving since they just hit the land at the top every time it's unfortunate i think uh bed rng might run away with this one i fear hate to say it all lands and snappy that would be sick <laughs> doubt it though God, it's me. <laughs> God, it's me. Let there be no counter spells. Let there be no memory lapses. Oh. Let there be no removal. They did just fire off two unholy heats. Realistically. Okay. They have three unholy heats. That's good. Love that for you. You're tapping out, though. Dark Ritual. I don't know. Maybe. Ritual, Necropotence, Vibes. I don't know if we're gonna get this, but we can try, right? They got themselves the snow covered. Okay, so this is not good. Because now they also still have the. I mean, I guess Snapcaster Mage keeps just bringing back memory lapse. And they look us out of drawing a card or drawing a land ever again. So sad. It's close, but I don't think... If the opponent plays this right, we never win. We just... We're purely relying on them fucking playing it like idiots. That's... <laughs> that's our current strategy. If the opponent plays this dumb, we're good. Yeah, yeah. If they play this like idiots, we're fine. That's our best bet right now. Opponents is act, act goofy. Sir? Ma Ma'am, this is a Wendy's. Why are you wasting your Snapcaster Mage? I guess that this like must mean that they have like another memory lapse or counter spell or something like that. Because Dark Ritual is literally revealed, so. Goofy Goober. Yeah, so they also have the Hall of the Storm Giants active still, which swings for like what a lot. I'll try it. I'll try it. I mean, I know they have something, right? Yeah. I, th I think we need to try as well. All right. Land Blood Moon keeps us alive. Nope. Brutal. Two lands has really killed us. Like, we kept a two land there. So did the opponent. But they managed to draw uh, eight lands. <laughs> we didn't. So, yeah, kind of different game there. Thank you.